wash hands and don appropriate PPE. For the purposes of this examination, I will just be wearing gloves. Hi, I'm Anya, I'm one of the doctors. Please, can I check your name and date of birth? Yeah, it's Matthew Black, 23rd of the 1st, 1992. Nice to meet you, Matt. I've been asked to do a thyroid examination on you today. That will involve having a look, a listen, a feel of your neck, which is where your thyroid gland is, and then just some other tests as well, like reflexes. Would that be okay with you? Yes. Okay. Are you in any pain at all? No. Okay. So first of all, I'm going to start off with general inspection, checking body habitus, um, tremors, if he's fidgety, and for example, how many layers of clothes he's wearing. Also, we'll include in this mobility aids and any kind of other vomit bowls, inhalers, anything else around the bed space. Next, I'm just going to have a look at your hands. So I'm checking for thyroid acropache, uh, the temperature of the hands, the perfusion, um, also checking for palmar erythema as well. And can I just get you to put your hands out in front of you and just keep them there? Just checking for fine tremor. Thank you very much. And now I'm just gonna check your pulses as well. Checking for rate, rhythm, and also the strength of the pulse. Do that for one full minute. Next, I'm just going to have a look at your face as well, checking for any kind of dry skin, sweating, any loss of the outer third of the eyebrow. I'd then move on and just have a look at the eyes as well, checking for any exophthalmus where the eye is protruding slightly out of the socket, any lid retraction as well, and any inflammation. Next, I'm just going to get you to do some eye movements. So if you can just follow my finger and just let me know if you get any pain or any blurry or double vision as you're moving your eyes. Any problems there at all? None. Perfect. And then I'm just going to check for lid lag as well. So I'm going to put my finger up and I'm going to move it down quickly. Just follow my finger with your eyes and just we're just checking to see if there's any kind of lag in your eyelid moving down. Do it once more. Thank you. So now I'm going to do a closer inspection of your thyroid. So that just involves having a closer look at your neck, just seeing if there's any obvious lumps, a swelling, any redness, any change in the skin. Looking a bit closer, there's nothing obvious that I can see. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to come and stand behind you and I'm just going to have a feel of your thyroid as well. So I'm just going to put my hands around here and can I get you to stick your tongue out and back in again and then also swallow please. Thank you. And I'm just going to have a feel for any uh, lumps, any swelling, any tenderness at all. No. Okay. And I'm just going to have a feel of your lymph nodes now, which are from underneath your chin, around your ears, the back of your head, and just into your shoulders as well. Now I'm just going to have a feel of your trachea and also just percuss down the front as well. And I'm now just going to percuss down your chest as well.
Thank you. And I'm just going to have a listen to your thyroid as well. So just a few final bits that we'll finish off with. I'm just going to test your reflexes first. Okay. Thank you. And we'll just do this arm as well. Perfect. So I just need to have a look at your shins. Just checking if there's any pretibial myxedema. Finally, I just need to check if you've got any muscle wasting associated with thyroid disease. So if I can just get you to cross your arms across your chest and then if you can stand up. Thank you, you can sit back down again. Thank you very much. So that concludes my examination and I'll just feed back to the examiner. I would like to perform thyroid function tests full blood count and user knees. I'd also like to do an ultrasound of the thyroid gland and an ECG.